yo what is up you guys apex boom welcome to another video as i always say today we have two separate drops which has been uh pretty much the new standard of my videos for now um like i said for now it's always very random it just depends on what's dropping in the following week and how many live cops i end up getting so we have the jordan travis scott collaboration and then we also have the jordan 13 red flints that also dropped today so without further ado let's get right into it First drop of the day, bright and early, we have undefeated at 8 a.m. Now, I'm gonna say this right now, it was totally unintentional that I went for these items. I was trying to go for the shoes because I thought they would drop on undefeated at the time, but they just released the clothes at around this time. So, <laughs> my total intention was not to cop any clothes at all, but as you guys will see in maybe, I don't know, 30, 30 45 seconds to a minute, that ended up being the case. Granted, I am happy. I still think I got very, very lucky because the item I still ended up copying still has a profit in it, which I'm very, very happy about. But still, it's still the fact that I didn't even mean to do that, but I still did it anyway. So of course you guys know the daily routine. Um, start all your tasks five to six minutes ahead of time. Make sure you have your keywords right. Make sure your keywords are, are straight up bulletproof, unfortunately. That was not the case for me this time. As you guys can see, I picked up the wrong items. Granted, there was still profit in all of the items, which I got lucky. I got completely lucky with that. But, you know, I just had to be more careful from, from now on. Literally, guys, I kid you not, I looked at the title of each product that was picked up. All I saw was Travis Scott X, X, X Jordan. And I was like, okay, cool. I picked up the right item. So I thought until I was getting ready, to, getting ready to check out again and I was looking also at the Discord monitor and I said, that's funny, no shoes picked up. Then I looked back again and read the full title and I was like, oh, utility vest. Hmm, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> but by that time it was literally too late. I was on checking order. So I tried to pause it knowing good and well it's still gonna go through anyways because obviously when it's on checking order it's processing the payment at that very moment so it's not just gonna stop magically processing the payment it's too late by that time so i ended up hitting one uh, utility vest in a size large which still has some profit in it which i'm very very happy about so i can't complain it was very unintentional but hey what can you do about it now granted i do have some sad news i was not able to go for any of the travis scott's the Jordan 6 is because I overslept for the kith release and that was literally the only release I planned on going for and I couldn't even go for the Sakai release because I had a final exam during that time period but you know can't complain you know can't complain won't complain let's go on to the next release which is the Jordan 13 red flints all right tea ladies and gentlemen next we have the Jordan 13 red flints as you guys can tell by the screen, I'm using Prism AIO for this release. I initially did not even plan on going hard for these shoes, if I'm being completely honest with you guys. My original goal was, see look, here's, here's how I planned it in my head. My original plan was, okay, I'll go for four pairs and leave it at that. Um, let me give you guys a little, a quick little story. I was, um, I was standing up last night and then out of nowhere, I was like, you know what? I actually think I'm gonna end up passing by this release. I don't think I wanna go for it anymore. Um, so I decided, screw it, I'm just gonna sleep in. Now, I woke up maybe about 8.30 a.m. today. And when I woke up, I was like, you know what? For some odd reason, let me check StockX just to see how prices are looking, to see if anything has dipped down yet or if anything has shot up. So prices were still looking pretty, they were still looking pretty average at that moment. Nothing has shot down yet. So I figured, you know what? Screw it, I'm gonna go for the release today, today and let's see what happens. So I decided to uh, end up setting up and started my task and nothing was really happening for the first six or seven minutes. Then out of nowhere, Prism started getting a bunch of carts and I started checking out almost immediately, which I'm very, very happy about. So I had all my credit cards and put it in. So I got about, I got three checkouts on my credit cards. And after that, I stopped all my tasks for my credit cards and I was gonna let my privacy cards do some work. So once I hit three, boom, I was very, very happy, but I still wanted a few more. So I think I went and just simply uh, filter all of my tasks through so only my privacy cards will only be the tasks that are going. So I went and did that. And by the way, let me also give a huge shout out to, of course, shout out to all of my sponsors, but Nocturnal Proxies really held it down for this drop. Without a doubt, that was the only proxies that were really cop what that were carding for me and they were actually checking out for both the ISPs and the residential proxies. Um, yeah, that's all I can say about that. Um, so I was, like I said, I filtered through my uh, 
my um my profiles so all of my privacy cards can actually end up going through granted here's something i really noticed you guys i don't know if you guys know this or not but um a few months ago remember how i used to always tell you guys i would have problems like with getting card expired so much with prism now granted i think i figured out the reason i used to get so many card expires is not because of prism itself but because of my privacy cards i don't know what it is about my privacy cards getting card expired um not going through and checking out all the way but you guys will literally see i have multiple tasks go to submitting order and then boom next thing you know card expired I don't know what the problem is all of my credit card tasks that ended up going through they went through flawlessly without no problem but when i was trying to actually do the same for my privacy cards it took a little bit more uh took a little extra work so i don't know exactly what the problem is but that's just one thing i paid attention to so it would be in my best interest to just use my um my credit cards more often from now on if i want to see more success more quickly without getting so many hiccups from the privacy cards now that doesn't say the privacy cards still don't work they still work flawlessly that's just one thing i really noticed uh, when i would use them now could be crazy i don't know i couldn't tell you but yeah um yeah you guys so started on my task again um i ended up getting a few more checkouts like i said i got a crap ton of cards a crap ton of cards but um nothing else really went through so i just continued to let it run and i ended up getting two more checkouts on Foot Locker. now I'm pretty sure you guys are you guys are wondering how many have actually went through and how many have gotten PV. I've only had one get PV from Foot Locker and everything else has stuck so far. I know I mentioned plenty of times before in the past how I would be like, oh, you know, I didn't get PV maybe because they felt sorry for me. Yeah, it seems like that's not really the case. Maybe I was just figuring I was getting I was really just getting lucky, but yeah. If you guys want me to in the future, I can do a video on um, how I actually modify my profile so I can get more orders to stick. It's nothing special I do at all. I do the same as everything else, so I think anyways. But if you guys want me to do that, I definitely will go into depth on that. But that's only if you guys want it. If you don't, I won't even worry about it. But yeah, you guys, this has been the Live Cop. A grand total of six pair of, of Jordan 13 Flint Red Flints were caught and one Travis Scott Jordan uh, utility vest was caught. Like I said before, one Jordan 13 got axed, so we have a grand total of five pair in total. But yeah, you guys, that's about it for this video. That wraps it up. I'm sorry I couldn't go for any more major releases. Um, I was screwing up. I had a final, overslept for the Travis, uh, the, the kit drop for Travis Scott's. So yeah, um, I'm gonna go and cry in bed now. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Totally joking. I'm about to go do something else. I don't know. Maybe get another video together or something. Thank you guys for watching. Please have a good night, day, evening, whenever you're watching this. I'll see you guys next time. Why is everything I say sound so repetitive today? I'll work on that. Deuces, guys.